Hi, this video demonstrates how to change grade category settings. I will use two tabs in my browser. The first one with a grade report and the second one which I will use to edit grade category settings. Have a look at user Celine. She has no grades at all and 30 points in overall. That's because three outcomes are present. We can change this behavior. Go to the category settings and exclude outcomes from aggregation. Now this student has zero points in total, although she has still no grades. Go to the category settings again and check aggregate only non-empty grades. Now category total field is empty as she has no grades. Let's have a look at the other part of grade report. There is one big category with subcategories and this is its aggregation column. What kind of settings we can apply to this category? We can for example change a strategy of aggregation. Possible values are mean of grades, median of grades and many more. I'll choose sum of grades. We can also include subcategories in aggregation. The last two options allow us to keep some of the highest grades and to drop some of the lowest. Choose number one to include the highest grade only. Reload the grade report. Here is an aggregation column of this category. As we can see, it contains the highest grade got by this user in this category and all of its subcategories. Now I'll show you one more thing. Enter a category creation form. It looks like this. Now log in as admin user and enter grade category settings from a grades menu. Here we can see the same options as before, but there are also force and advanced checkboxes that have impact on appearance of category creation form. Let's mark some options as advanced and force the other ones. Reload the form. Now some options are hidden and we need to click Show Advanced button to display them. Values of some other options are set at the top level and the teacher is not allowed to change them. That's all. Thank you for watching this video.